Okay, so this is a, a quick intro to using um, a Google Drawing to create something useful. Google Drawing can create complicated layouts. It's a little bit like Microsoft Publisher, but it integrates with um, Google Drawing and Google Documents to create the sort of complicated documents that you might want to make. Okay, so to get to Google Drawing, you just go to your drive, click on Create Drawing. I've created this one already. I've renamed it Year 8S, um, and this could be a seating plan. So if I click on the text box tool there, create a box. This is going to be where somebody sits. I'm not going to put anything in it yet. I'm going to give that line uh, a black color, I think. So I've got a black box there. I'm going to copy that box paste it and I'm going to put those two boxes next to each other like that kind of sort of helps you do it and I'm going to hold shift down click on that one so I've got both of them selected now right click group and I'm going to copy them and I'll paste so that something looks a bit like a table let's put that one I don't know there depends on your classrooms laid out I guess and then hold shift down again and I can select both sets of tables copy paste and now I can just quickly put in blocks of tables like that. Suppose I just wanted to go back to a pair so I ungroup copy that one paste and maybe I want that one over there. Maybe I'll actually want it rotated so I can just spin it around like that and then I want to do paste again and maybe I've got a table something like that over there and maybe let's group that again shift group copy and paste and let's move the table over here but that one's at a bit of an angle so it's something I don't know like that. I want to put some names in, so just double click on the box. Amy's there. Fred is there. Jack's going to sit there. Um, Mike is going to sit there. And um, Claire is going to sit there and so on. And that's automatically saved in your Google Docs. You can do simple things like um, print it and just print. Or you can do slightly funkier things like you can uh, click on web clipboard, copy the entire drawing to web clipboard and then you can go to the web clipboard in another Google application and paste that in. Say onto a PowerPoint slide, uh, onto a, a presentation slide or into a um, spreadsheet that's got your class list in or something like that. But if you think the table, the thing needs moving around and they need moving up there, uh, you can, oops, you can easily move these around. If you want to move more than one at a time, just remember to group them together. And I can just move that one down there and I'll move those back over there. So you can move it around pretty easily and pretty quickly. Anyways, hope that's useful.